Let me go send advertisements. Okay. Ah yes, that is right. I have Jahira because that way she is not stolen from us. I recall this now. Yeah. I was like, why do I have Jahira? Oh right. <laughs> I said excuse me. You are excused. I did not need your excuse. <laughs> <clears throat> I did not need you to excuse me. Or to pardon me. <laughs> oh, right. The uh, creepy red dwarf is just right over here. Hurry up, hurry up, oh. come outside, come outside, leave okay. the doors, leave the doors, leave the doors, <laughs> leave the doors, leave the doors, walk outside the doors, let's go, let's go, I'm coming let's outside. go, let's go, be faster, be faster. You're downstairs and across the street already. I am already outside, because you are <laughs> slow as fuck. <laughs> Okay, I am here. Afternoon. Nice. Alright, hang on, hang on. There we go, there we go. And you should quick save so that way. There we go. Now, remember, we don't want the lady drinking the wine, right? That's true, yeah. Okay, do you want to do the talking? Do the talking, do the talking, do the talking. Yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Why, hello there. We were just about Why, to hello there. Delightful wines. Oh, I can see you running around. They do look ever so tasty. The wine here is cool. Oh, Mrs. Highbury, I prefer to conduct tasting like me, and that's <laughs> like you. And you were well, hello, Katie. Face. What if I Welcome in. <laughs> what if I just <laughs> set you on fire? Could I do that? I could do that. That would be fun. Wine's no good without company, after all. It's pretty ironic because I'm actually playing a monk, so I'm like crazy fast. Uh, oh my, I think I failed my insight. In mm. <laughs> Her face is cosmopolitan. I must say, if this is a practical joke, it's not very amusing. Why, a serial killer? Oh, that's terrible. Master Mensley, are you quite all right? It was perfect. Could I just... Perfect, perfect, quick save, quick perfect. save, quick save. Oh, yeah, yeah. I missed my insight check, so I couldn't do this subtly. <laughs> all right, it's all right, it's all right. Should you interfere again? Oh, they're able to get away. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. Did at least work some ways. Tastes like four I of forgot them. that I have Jahira in I have Jahira in the silver armor. I'm like, who the hell is that? They're all huddled around, they're like, okay guys. The game plan is we stabbing people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's the that's the game plan. Huh? If I No, no, no. There's too many innocent people around. <laughs> let's not, let's not do the Don't AOE resonate. thing. <laughs> well, no, I wasn't. 
I was going to do something that's possibly equally as AoE-ish. Ah, I see. But I'm not going to do that now. <laughs> Good job. You know, there's a guy in red who's right next to Karlak. Oh. Oh, hell, there is. He is right behind me. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's right behind me. <laughs> Sorry, behind me, isn't he? <laughs> yeah, missed. Give him another poke. One right behind me, isn't there? <laughs> You're not going anywhere. <laughs> There's four. <laughs> I didn't notice the ones grouped up together. That's hilarious. Yeah, yeah, I was pointing that out. That's why I was like, yeah, the game plan is we stabbing people. <laughs> I didn't notice that. <laughs> so. The problem is there's there's a bunch of boxes kind of like sitting in the way, which is a little awkward for me. Oh. So they're like right below my view. Gotcha. Right, we jump. There we go. And then we attack. Do you hear? Why do you only have one sword? I don't know. I was just thinking Jihira? that too. <laughs> why do you only have the one? Do you hear? Ma'am. Madam. Also, can I just... Can I... My cat! No! <laughs> okay. Cat slightly uh, in the way you're burning hands. Cat slightly right there. <clears throat> Hello, Key West! Yes, chaos! <clears throat> uh, uh, AoE's probably just slightly too big. Yep, okay. <laughs> They're right there. I could do almost anything. Downside is... There's civilians everywhere. Yeah. And the cat. Well, look, the cat's not real, right? <laughs> cat is a figment, so... Sorry, cat. Love you. The cat is like cake. You mean the cat is a lie? <laughs> the cat is a lie. And. Whee! Out of stabbing range. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he paralyzed me. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, no, Boog. Oh, no. And now Jahir is paralyzed, too. You'd think you'd have some sort of monk thing against being paralyzed. Yeah. Oh, no. A morphic ambush. I'm so surprised. <laughs> Just poked him. <laughs> uh, let me see. Okay, He's naked. And <laughs> ugly. Where's his pants? <laughs> Gross. Messed with that one. Like, there's one guy who's cowering in fear, and then there's people just walking by. <laughs> you pan the camera out far enough. No. Oh, he. What? That was a level four? What the fuck? I guess he really wanted out. I guess so. Dick bag? Tormented. 
Anyway. <laughs> Just keep stabbing Boog. No, I said Boog. Uh, Unstable backlash. That's the thing that allows uh, Carlac to Ow! random. Oh shit! Randomly My swap kidneys. through her uh, uh, her wild magic oh, right. effect yeah. every time she yeah, gets yeah. hit. My gnome kidneys. Oh. Here, let me see if I can help you. My knitneys. <laughs> Sounded better in my head. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Stun him too. Yes. Okay. Good. Good. Got him. Before he strikes again. Oh, I'll that one later. Come under here. There you go. Time to collect some knives. Knife, 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 knife. Dagger, 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 dagger. <laughs> Hello. Hello there, my name's Molly the Orphan. Thank you for helping Cora. Someone named me I that. Her. And there's Timmy the Orphan too. To yeah, 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 okay, whatever. Hello, Timmy. We probably didn't know you were going to be an orphan. <laughs> Can't believe I'm trying to read. <laughs> Thank you for saying Oh no, Boog. Do you remember Efren? One of the flaming fist? I think so. That name does sound slightly familiar. I think he was one um, of the ones Joaquin's I saw. Rest? Out, yeah, at Joaquin's rest, I was about to say. Yeah. One of those is his kid! Oh no! Yeah, Boog. Do you want to tell his kid or should I? Uh, is it Timmy? I don't know. Thank you thank you. Oh, well, I can't actually, uh. Go read one of them. Thank you I wonder if, like, you read the letters I... and then. Oh, there he is! I bet it's that kid. For no reason at all. <laughs> Going by certain assumptions. <laughs> oh! Uh, excuse me? Lady Mazora told me everything. How you and the Blade of Frontiers oh, slaughtered right. his own father. How he craves ultimate power. How he means to make the city bow to him and him alone. First I finish you. Then I finish the Duke's traitorous son. Uh. Uh. A boog. A boog. Can you, uh, quick save for me? <laughs> Thank you. I have no charisma. <laughs> But at least I have a big wizard brain. <laughs> you remember the stories of Altarel's fall? The city was dragged into the hells at Zariel's behest, and Ravenguard along with it. Hey, Finn doesn't look like she's dying anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Stand down. 
Oh, oh that's right. It. I believe you. I probably can't I trust a, a, a conniving Dark demon woman. What was us. I thinking? Oh, man. Listen, there's something Will should know. On his way from Eltera, Ravenguard sent a messenger with word of the cult. He knew about the Absolute. I thought little of it at first, but he realized the danger before anyone else did. He understood that if the cult was successful in raising an army, Baldur's Gate would be doomed. And he knew that to protect the city, one trained in the ways She's of the great champions would have to again. rouse the worm mm -hmm. beneath. If I'm not mistaken, nice. that then would again, be the sun weird. is shining directly on her face. So, you know. <laughs> there's a dragon under the city. Boog, there's a dragon living under the city. A bronze dragon, to be precise. Sleeping Boog, there's a bronze dragon living under the city. The worm goes by Boog many wants names. to meet the dragon. Also, the waiting storm. The heart of the gate. He made Baldurin a binding promise to protect the city when its need was greatest. The city survived countless threats, but Ravenguard knew its walls would fall to the cult. With him gone and the city near ruin, your call is to unleash is just the standing heart behind of the gate. me. <laughs> Take this just for you know the legend of support. Ansel. <laughs> the bards call it a tall tale, Ooh, but every book. last word. I'm is definitely true. gonna read that. <laughs> and not eat it. Follow its path to the worm, or do not, and let the coast be drowned in blood. Uh. Sure. I was right to lay down yes. my arms. Books oh, do I'm not afraid. taste good. I should go gather allies. We'll join Too much is paper. That my... Boog? Free is that why my book collection is and may his thunderous wind drive the absolute um, from the coast. Ah. Uh... Boog. Uh, Boog sees something over there. He's going to. Uh, Boog's going to check it out. Uh huh. Uh, okay. Boog only found the dead bodies of the enemies we were already fighting. Uh, where does Min want to go next? Uh, there's, you see that weird, big, giant, shiny globe thing over there? Uh. Right here? Right in front of us? This thing? Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. Look how shiny it is. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, Anders in front of it. <gasps> hey, bitch, what's up? It's shiny like Boog. Hello, Aridin. Let me back in. I'll bring Laroakin out here, you tin tube. You tell Laroakin I went for his goddamn night song, and now he has to pay up. What are you looking at? Shit, you are. Uglier than I remember. You were looking for the night song after me. <laughs> Please tell me you found it. Uh. Who are you trying to get at inside? Laroakin, the wizard who sets out the contract. He owns this place, and his little page boy inside knows how to get to him. Laroakin said it'd be easy money. A smash and grab. Get in. Get the night song. Go. Turns out wow. little hey, was in the temple of Shah. Or can fucking lie to you. Would never have taken my people in if I'd known. I can't bring them back. But I can make Laroa can cough up. Especially if you found the relic. Can I just Hey you. Huh. Man, I'm so good at talking. <laughs> it's gonna go so well. Okay, got it. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I was holding my breath. There's <laughs> fewer people along the way than I did. Laroakin should have warned us. Yeah. Sod it. Enough. 
Larokian and his precious knights home just about ruined my life. If you value yours, I'd steer well clear of this place. Can I just throw money at you, Aridin? Where'd you go? Aridin? No? <laughs> Damn. He didn't even, like, walk away. He just fucking vanished after that. Well, every now and then he'll tell you that he's at a an inn and to find him there, and then it's like, okay, I will give, you know, but I can never find what inn. Right. And then I just want to, like, give him money, you know? <laughs> Oh my god! It's rolling! <laughs> rolling! Oh, rolling! <laughs> rolling, why do you look like shit? Rolling, why do you look like shit? Nothing for you to worry about. But never mind that. What can I do for you? Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> Who wonders how a clerk gets so many bruises on his face. <laughs> Be very sure before you make to visit the Roican. He's got a beastly temper. But if you really do you know something, like he'll shit? want to see you. Head upstairs. You can find the way into his tower up there. Boog, see if you can talk to him and do the insight. Also, quick save. Because I think that the only way that we can Get him on our, our side is if we pass the insight. Boog thinks you look a little rough. Nothing for you to worry about. His voice catches. Oh, there we there go. There we go. Something's wrong here. But never mind that. What can I do for you? Hmm. Yeah, it's just I guess an insight check. Uh... Very sure Ooh, before you he make looks to visit like the me Rowan. on a good day. He's got a beastly temper. But if you really do know something, he'll want to see you. Head upstairs. You can Boog find has sympathy for you, Ro uh, Rowan. Tell me who hurt you. <laughs> Tell Boo who hurt you. Let's see. Oh, there's something here. Our elemental looks God, like haven surrounded by bugs for the like first time since oh okay I don't even have to play uh, origin Karlak in order to get this dialogue Karlak's talking to the love elemental <laughs> the elemental's blank visage stares back You sense an unfathomable depth behind the shifting crevices of its face. A pleasant heat passes through you. Wait, can I talk to it some more? <gasps> stares back at you. As you start to sing. Yes. Yeah. Look, they have a book I need. <laughs> of Carsus would no doubt have much to say about the crone's true nature. If only you could read them. Bye. Books as temperamental as these are not on sale. They are secured in our vault. When consider yourself lucky to have learned of such a book's existence and then forget about it. The annals of Carsus are best left unread. <laughs> oh no. Ray, you are a bait upon my existence. Why <laughs> you do you do this to me? <laughs> you walk over listening on my conversation and now I fail it. That's a 17 and a nat 20. Did you walk away from my conversation? No, I'm still here. <laughs> I was thinking about it. Because <laughs> I chewed you out, isn't it? <laughs> the only way to gain access to the vault is through my office. 
And before you ask, no, Aww. you are not allowed in there either. Is there any amount of gold? I already okay. told you. Okay, thank you. You said. Also, hey, Boog, you should yeah. talk to her about her books. Literature department. Can I help you? Why are you whispering? Books have feelings? Who did not know of this? Is that true, Books? Are you sensitive? Boog has learned something today. Yes? Come back when you've cobbled together some manners and are prepared to pay for the Books taxes. have feelings. Yes. They can. That's better. How can I help you? Oh, Roland. Roland, I love you. Scrolls. Parchments, codices, tomes. Take a look and see what calls you. Season the saving will throw against a spell, they regain hit points. Ooh, Boog, he's got a robe you'll want. Ooh. It's very expensive, though. How much do I have? Oh. Nothing. What? No, that's. What? No, that sounds. How could you have nothing? <laughs> it's okay. That money helps both of us. <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> oh. Ooh. Ooh. He's got a staff that would let me cast spiritual weapon. Oh, nice. Ooh, that is. Hmm. Hmm. Ooh. Gold. It's all about profits, my love. Hmm. What will we do in the meantime? So my current stick uh, gives me a plus one to my ranged spell attacks and gives me resistance to fire damage. Also lets me cast a fire bolt and a fire ball. Okay. Uh, but this gives me two to nine damage and lets me cast spiritual weapon. I wanted. Hmm. Just to have it. Hey, hey, Boog. Yes? Hey, Boog. Do you want to take a nap and then piss off a wizard? Uh, yes. Okay. Well, first we should piss off the wizard and then go take a nap. Oh. I think that's the right way to do it, right? Place yeah, I think we can do it that way. Quick save and then we'll make sure. Because if we can't, we can just reload. No big deal. This is the same wizard that hurt Roland. Yes. Welcome I would be very to excited to meet him. If you have information about the he looks like a bitch. Song, great <laughs> await. If you are here to waste the night great song. wizard Laroican's time, reconsider. Let your knowledge determine your path forward. I 
I wanted to read the sign. The night song is an immortal being, the child of a deity. Well, you did choose but the right one. I think I clicked the correct hole. Yeah, you did. I checked the sign after you went in. <laughs> improved but uh still leave something up to chance <laughs> fucking s so gnome swagger <laughs> all right crank hello stinky Ready? aim oh. hmm. uh, <laughs> i see no night song Surely you wouldn't have entered my tower without the night song in hand? Surely you wouldn't have wasted my time? Mm. The night song's too big to be in our hands. Be the wizard. And you must have an answer to my request. If you want to keep your head, of course. <laughs> the night song. Do you have it or not? Boop doesn't like threats from silly bookman. She? Then you do know her. You've been to Shah's temple. To the Shadowfell. You've looked upon the yeah, Min's songs not looking great again. <laughs> <laughs> Once she's out of direct <laughs> sun. <laughs> Be careful what she'll wish for. She'll eat you alive. I'm growing tired of this repartee, my friend. Let us cut to the chase. Beautiful. What the Isn't fuck? Isn't it? Worth more than your life, too. But I thought wizard men always like to talk. A warlock. They really do. Very little of his soul left to him. Can bind a celestial to the wearer's service with a snap of the fingers. And this. This can keep her in place. Forever. I remember it lying to him about it just kind of ends the conversation. Yeah. It didn't work out for poor Kethrick, did it? He was a fool. Boog. A desperate mercenary who hauled out his soul. Yes, Why do wizards wear dresses like that? <laughs> I serve no god. But that which stares back at me in the mirror. The night song will be put to a actually does not have an answer for that. Also, he just said that he's a god because he looks at himself in the mirror. Hmm. I'll go fetch her. I'll look forward to my reward. What do you think? Quick save, make sure that that's an okay answer. Yeah. Book thinks he's Lied being to be broken. Yeah. <laughs> and me mine. Me mine? Me mine? Me mine. Book, he said <laughs> me mine. That sounds very dumb. <laughs> Boog, he sounds like a moron. <laughs> Me mine. <laughs> Dumb. Uh, what if we do it this way?
Okay. Uh oh. Yeah, I've never seen this one before. Well, I've never seen this before. Okay. Do not fail any of these roles. This is no child. Okay. This is a shapeshifter who intends to Like you'll probably want to do sleep. some savings. I saw her. She slipped into camp in the form of a woman and shifted into this abomination. She tried to silence me and hide her deception. Also notice how Lazel's wearing her helmet. Mhm. Mm She knows we outnumber her. Say your farewells, Nevukrim. Okay. You need to stop Lazel from knowing this. Damn. Close, but not close enough. Reload this as many times as we need to. Yeah. <laughs> this gave me so much stress the first time I had this happen. <laughs> I literally looked up a guide and I was sweating so hard because I was so freaked out. Because this is what I mean by the children must not die. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. this this freaked me the fuck out. I was like, oh god. I'm pretty sure it has to be intimidation because I don't think Absolutely I'm that good at persuasion. Yes. Okay, there we go. That'll do. You turn on me to save this ignorant well. Do I mean so little to you? Look at it, crawling and sniffing and rooting around in the filth. Is it my nether stone you seek, little piggy? I don't want anything to do with your nethers. Two completely different answers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, she took Lazel. Oh, apparently, yeah. No, not a thing. <laughs> Still gasping and gagging on the foul airs of Ball's temple. <gasps> I will not slice. Her kind die too easily. Is that a naked lady the on your Lord crown? Demands a better <laughs> offering. Something new. Sticky, sweet, and delicious. Boog, you're not that sweet. You. <laughs> A little sticky, but not sweet. Boog is tough and probably doesn't taste too good. No, you don't. Alright, what? <laughs> Hi, Jack. I see a hedgehog, too. Silly little worm. <laughs> My god is always with me he shudders to see how my blades plunge into soft surrendered flesh you are dull a blunt blade unfit to flay but you could be sharpened thin and jagged pretty sure that's a naked lady on her crown yeah. yes I will tell you what to do huh 
I don't think I've ever noticed that before. <laughs> I don't think so either. I think it's because you're tall enough. You'd prefer my whispers in the tyrant's tongue? Hmm? Heard Gortash's whispers. I see how your skull swarms with his promises. Oh, he winches totally and wails in the crown of Carsus, <laughs> wanting to command it without me. Oh, how I long to slit his poxy smile from ear to ear. But I can't touch him. He bound my blade when we first conspired. Gortash didn't want me at first. Didn't trust me. Got me to wag my tongue, swear an oath, never to hang him from the hooks. Trip drain him into father's open jaws. You must kill the tyrant. Take the netherstone from his corpse and bring it to my temple. There we slice and shred each other. The survivor claims the stones. What's left of the other is bars. Agree, and I will bring my assassins to heal. They watch you always, longing to spray the crimson from your veins. Refuse me, and you'll learn what happens to those who defy Baal's doctrine. So will your friend. Orin demands a fight to the death. The prize for the victor, the Nether Stones. I was trying to figure out who she meant by friend, and, and then I realized she was talking about Lazel, because I was like, but I'm right here. Refuse, and your companion's life may be forfeit, as might your own. Orin's assassins will hunt you like prey for slaughter. Yeah, but the nice part is we don't have to worry about her trying to kill Yenna anymore. Yeah. Also, I like how I'm in the bottom corner. <laughs> <laughs> of slaughter, of pain and humiliation, and the sound of blood drip dropping into the gutter. Do not underestimate his steel watch. Seek their cradle in the lower city and skewer their skull meat. Make them rust and blood. Then you can gore the lordling again and again and again. Listen close, bone killer. Step in my domain. I don't kill bones. Excuse me. <laughs> you can't kill bones. How are you gonna kill a bone? Explain to me, Orin, how you kill bones. They have to be alive first. Bones are not alive. Exquisite butchery. The victor. Dumbass. <laughs> that is bone killer. What the fuck? He will not make another. The balls offer or your offer, hip bones. Anyway. Uh, suddenly I'm heavily encumbered. What the fuck? Oh, you have Lazel's items, I bet. Oh, yeah, you know what? I think that is. There's Grub. Yeah, those are Lazel. It's Lazel's backpack. Eh. Eh. There's Yenna. Gotta make it over to the box. Eh. Hey, it's okay. You're safe now. Huh? Eh. Oh, come comfort the child. Hang on. I just gotta... Put this backpack in here. Wait. Oh, okay. Okay. There we go. So hoping she would take Gale, but no, no, she took Lay fucking Zell. 
I wonder it's probably because of the fact we didn't go under the tower. Yeah. No, I'm well, not. At least we know Yen is safe. I'm not safe ever again. Just point me. You're supposed Aww. to be taken. I'm sorry, Yenna. Oh, now she's just angry. <laughs> there we go. Good girl. There we go, Boog. Also, hey, Aelin. Mother's milk, your visage speaks of ill tidings. Speak, ally mine. <laughs> What troubles you? You have not given me uppies, and it makes me <laughs> sad. Also, a wizard called Laroakin is looking for you. Is he indeed? Pray tell, what does he seek from Dame Aelin? Dumbassery. <laughs> Put a contract out for your capture. Magicians and their machinations. I have had enough for an eternity. I will wring right. his neck until he's dead. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's do it together. His end will be one more strand in the great braid of our friendship. Yes! I'm coming with you. <laughs> I'd like to get a few licks in myself. My darling, we agreed you'd scout for the nearest Salunite enclave oh. this very night. I got Let so us excited. divide our efforts. All the sooner to be reunited. I won't let you go alone. Who knows what this wizard might have planned? Our closest ally will accompany me. Won't you? That's me. That's it me. It will be a swift and fruitful trip. <laughs> I'm a wing. <laughs> I we to this Laroican right away. I am as eager to meet him as he is to ensnare me. Yes. Yes. Whoosh. To bed. To bed. <laughs> to bed. Aelin did not go out the door, by the way. It's fine. Before we went to She'll sleep, I saw her, like, head into, like, the middle area. This is why you don't watch the NPCs leave. <laughs> it takes away from their coolness. <laughs> How are we this morning, small child? That was so scary. Oh my gods. <laughs> We're back now, safe, and we can have soup. I made it. Want some? Yes. Uh, sure. I'll take your soup. Oh yeah, you sell soup now. Ha <laughs> ha! Success. So apparently in order to get her to be a soup salesman, we have to let her get grabbed. Get traumatized. Yeah. I mean, that's not the only way, but... Eh. Mizora has something to say. Well, Mizora can suck my... Mizora... My Miz <laughs> yeah. Something on your mind? Can you stop you that? Know exactly what's on my mind. Stop stealing me into conversations. I am trying <laughs> to do things with my inventory. I sent my you a gift for that. <laughs> no. <laughs> for the Duke's untimely yeah. demise. Such a loyal servant of the city. So eager to hear of your exploits. Tell me, darling, how is she? What a relief. It would be a shame if she'd struck down the one and only blade. Alas, she misses the fallen duke. Someone will need to step up in his absence. A man with the spirit of a dragon. His only son, perhaps. The Absolutists worked a number on me at Moonrise. And you're the best hope I've got at payback. 
No one crosses the Hell's children without getting scorched. Okay, that's that's fair, but can you can you do that without being like a devious bitch for like once? Just one time. Probably not. It doesn't seem like it. Correct. If you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel. Question Those though. Cursed shadows were thick enough. I woke in that yes. Is Boog going to accept my the seduction? And my most powerful magics. No. <laughs> Really? Kind, benevolent soul set me free. Even though I think Karlak is like the only one that like actually forgives you. Uh no, that's I still don't want to, I don't want to do that to her. Oh come on. Why? I'm supplied. I'm so curious. <laughs> when the time comes to do it. Given. Not even at the point where she's offering it yet. <laughs> oh, so you'll take what you know, you'll you'll pay attention to women Thara has to say, but you're not gonna have fun with oh okay, whatever. You know what? No, it's fine. What? Whatever. I don't care. Why don't you take her up on her deal when she offers it? No. <laughs> Because... Ew. <laughs> Excuse me. Besides, what was it? I think Minthara said I was smart. <laughs> or or she called me a friend or something. No, I think she said it Boob was smart. That's what it was. Mizora's just a uh fucking royal bitch like ninety percent of the time. And then she turns around and she's like, oh, hey, I've been watching you. You want a rumple? <laughs> All right, let's do this. Quick save. Just in case we fuck everything up. Okay. Don't need to have Jihiro with me. Could Maybe in a run else. where I don't, like, actually seek anybody's companionship. But even in a video game, I feel kind of bad about cheating. I could have taken somebody else. I want to see if I can do this with a druid, though. Yes, Aelin ass, yes! <laughs> a magician in a tower. You were the Hiding one who went in first. Why am I here? <laughs> what are you so scared of? Is it because I'm a wizard? Not the night song. Wizard sure. off. Wizard off! <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> and pursued. Oh, hey. God. The night song is <laughs> At last. Okay, Roland. We'll keep you alive. That's why I have Jahira. You will address me with true difference. <laughs> I am Dame Aelin. And you are a whelp without honor, without pride, with nothing but a tower full of trinkets. I want Aelin to give me up his... <laughs> I meant no disrespect. I asked our mutual friend here to make an introduction that I might get to meet the famed daughter of Saluna. Forgive me for that impudence. Perhaps our friend can bridge the gap and do what I believe they came here to do? Yeah, I'm here to take the book from you. <laughs> you have a book I want. You 
Games. You're like, yeah. Welcome. I've come here to steal all of your books, Leroican. <laughs> Welcome to the ultimate wizard betrayal. I'm here to kill you and take all of your books, bitch. You <laughs> who has all realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. <sighs> Threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years. You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. Oh man, so do we. <laughs> oh, oh my god. <laughs> Pity you didn't prove a more reliable ally. You could have reaped the rewards of my good favor. You mean all of the things you have in your tower that I can take when you're dead? You're determined to make this as difficult as possible. You're lucky I didn't have the ability to make bones from all the stuff in my bag. must go directly into the caging room. No, Master Lerokin. I would never have assisted you if I knew you planned such horrors. You lied to get the night sock here. Made us all believe she was nothing but a relic. I have seen what true leadership can accomplish. Yeah. But never under your <laughs> Wait, you mean me? <laughs> oh God, Boo, he means me. I think that sounds excellent bargain. Boo. Face us, charlatan. We who detest you so. Boog, help, he means me. <laughs> Boop wonders which one of us is really in charge, and whether either of us is really, uh, qualified to be in charge. Maybe he meant Jahira? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, that, that's what it was. He meant Jahira, yeah. <laughs> Really? Okay, hang on. Don't move. Don't move. It's Jump okay. Jump into the center. I can't move anyway. <laughs> Not my turn. Okay. It is a shame that the little gnome or halfling guy sides with Leroican. Like, I get why, but also... My dude. He put an apple on your head. <laughs> right. Like. He, he ain't gonna help you. <laughs> I wonder. It is animated armor. Does heat metal work on it? Science! Yes. Yeah. Yes, it, it does. does. <laughs> That's kind of cool. part is, is now they fucking equip the weapon instead of, you know, you cast Flame Blade and then it, you have to equip it. Oh, really? That was a pain in, yeah, that was a pain in the ass. It made me oh, do wow. that a lot. That was the other reason why I hated Will for a while. Uh. Because it didn't auto-equip it. Uh-huh. <laughs> that was a nightmare. 
I see, yeah, that sounds like it. I thought I had dynamite. Dynamite? Ooh, dynamite. <laughs> Dominate? Yeah, thought that I had that one instead of, uh, telekinesis equipped, but no, apparently not. Sorry, buddy. Now. Okay. Spooks, time to shine. Do I have? Yes, I do. Also, I just realized <laughs> I'm still carrying the fucking rune powder bomb for some reason. <laughs> Please to not. Oh, no, no, no. I, I am not going to do that. Almost the body. And... The rule again. Stunned. You killed the level one guy. Yeah, the uh, the key explosion got him. Uh, no. Oh damn! Whoops. <laughs> ah well. For a second, I forgot what psionic dominance is, and uh, I wasted it. No big deal. Transmuted to steel. Oh no. Ow. Roland, no. Hey. What was that? Oh, that's uh, one of her wild magic effects, where she can I, shoot it a. It said wild magic, yeah, but what did the what was that supposed to do? It was a beam of light from her chest. Bolt of light does one d one d six damage, and can blind okay, a target if it hits them. That was the answer. Was the one d six? Yeah. What does a bolt of light do? <laughs> so it comes from her chest, but what does it do? I mean, it, it you know, it's a bolt of light, but what does it do? <laughs> yeah, 1d4 damage. Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, armor class has increased by 2, but its movement speed has been reduced by 20 feet. So it's got an AC of 20 right now. I'm about to heat metal on that bitch, oh, yeah. so... It's got resistance to, like, all kinds of damage, too, so... <laughs> oh, well, all kinds of it physical damage. It transmuted to steel. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> hey. Cause for by some reason means. it thought that was the right idea. <laughs> Stay alive, motherfucker. <laughs> what do you mean, target must be a metal? It's literally transmuted to steel <laughs> okay that is officially annoying and i yeah. hate it fine um Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, we've got some elementals of our own. Haha! <laughs> 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 <Wee. laughs> Didn't expect that, did you? Haha! <laughs> Nobody expects the Vanish Inquisition. <laughs> Are you gonna telekinesis him? Oh yeah! <laughs> <laughs> nice! <laughs> oh, that just felt good! Um, that felt good! I wanted to see if I could throw him away. It did not work to throw him away. But I could throw him towards. That was great. <laughs> he stands up to do, eh, and then lays back down again. <laughs> that officially just made this fight better for my soul. I zoomed in and his foot did a little twitch. <laughs> Oh, incredible. Min, why you hunker down like that? <laughs> She's just like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm almost done, Laroken. I've just got one more bonus attack left. Ah, there we go. And then, is there any enemies in range? Just one, I think. Okay. Ow! With him dead, Myrmidons would go away, but no. <laughs> Get him, Alan. Get him. Two rows. 
Also good, we never gave him the chance to do elemental retort. Which good I now job, realize uh, gets powered up because of all the elementals that he has around him. Yeah, but I also threw him, and I mean... Yeah, that was fucking hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta let me have my victories where I can, okay, man? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Also, it turns out Jihira is the one who had the uh, hold person on her. Which uh. is why I was confused. So. Oh. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> Look, Boog, there's mo many of me now. Oh, no. <laughs> what do you mean, oh, no? Boog can, can barely handle one min. Now there's no, four. No. It's because you got hit in the head really hard. Uh, that's, that's why you're being mean. <laughs> True, maybe that's why Boog sees four of you. <laughs> No, no, I made multiples of me. Jerk. I forgot about that guy. <laughs> He's just been over there, slowly dying of heat metal. <laughs> Holy shit. Damn, Alan. Nice. Yeah, that's right, Roland. Get him. <laughs> and I definitely won't do what I thought I was going to do, which was I was going to make Roland into bones. <laughs> Remembered that we don't do that. Cause that's bad. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes. You who would purchase my submission <laughs> with profane gold. Let every wicked make us. I love how we were like each We're gonna let her do this, right? <laughs> yes, do it, Aelin! Break him! Is indomitable. Mm -hmm. And when her face lights the shadows of your wrongdoing, you are broken by it. Yes! <laughs> also, she gave Laroic an uppies. <laughs> Those weren't uppies, Boog. <laughs> Those were not up uppies, Boog. <laughs> Trust me. Uppies. <laughs> nice little net of the earth beneath the crunches, or the bones within. The 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 earth that's in. It's crunching. <laughs> yeah. Not not the bones. Aelin. The firehead fool is dead. Yet as I stare upon his corpse, I feel sadness. Why? A gripping in the chest. As though I'd lost someone. Something. Uh, uh, Paladin's fatigue, no doubt. You were excellent in battle, as is your way. And I am proud to fight at your side. And you, tiefling, you did not embarrass yourself. I will catch my breath, then to camp I will bring my bones. I am not a tiefling. Moon made me with For a second I was like, what are you talking about? Carlock was awesome. Then I'm like, oh wait, she means Lo uh, fucking Roll Roland. Roland. <laughs> Yes. Kick him in the Nashers. <laughs> the boss 
Ambassador's dead. I am. Now that the bastards and bits. Laroa can I have a portion. Vicious man. <laughs> By day, I'd tend the shop, but at night, he'd fire the most nonsensical questions at me. Like and Boog for every does? one I answered wrong, <laughs> he'd beat me. Oh. Oh. Not like Boog I could have killed him with my own two hands. But I kept thinking it was all a test. It had to be. I thought it was the price I had to pay to become Boog a true would never wizard. raise a hand against you, Mend. I realize now... Not even if you couldn't answer sick, whether or not a hot dog sick, was a sandwich or a taco. Because <laughs> he was saying that Lorogan was firing off nonsensical questions at him and then hurting him if he could, didn't have an answer for it. Yes. I didn't... What was the question? I, if a hot dog was a sandwich or a taco. Oh, this man is over here pouring his heart out and having an existential crisis and that's the question you ask me? <laughs> I see things clearly now. If I wish to master the weave, I must do it myself. Thankfully, I have everything I need right here. Just imagine him sitting on his throne of books, holding up a little, like, <laughs> straw. Roland, oh, I like the sound of that. does the straw have one hole or two? I'll move Cal and Leah in immediately. <laughs> the Roican refused to let them stay here. They are going to love the tower. That I sounds have this, awesome, Roland. The tower, my family, without you, what can I do to thank you? There's a vault with a book that I need. <laughs> Let me take the books, and that's all. Mm. Quick save. Okay. What's mine is yours. Take what you please. Aww. Leave only the books and scrolls. But know this. Ramazith Tower and its master are now your friends. And when the time comes, we will stand by you as allies. Roland, will you give me your bees? <laughs> Look, Boog. My multiples are gone. Ooh. Oh my god, quick save. <laughs> oh. Can I... Oh, okay. I thought you were going to try to speak with dead with him. Oh, I should have. <laughs> Would you like to reload? Reload. Okay. <laughs> I forgot that your ultimate form of punishment is turning your enemies into skelly men's that work for you. <laughs> I guess we'll do this the smart way. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Be <gasps> you like talking to dead people. Shut up, phone. Do you think if skeletons were people, that boner would be in a would be a slur for them? <laughs> All right. Um. 
Um, let's see. Do this fun. Uh, this. And if he won't talk to you because you killed him, I do have a uh, disguise kit if you don't have disguise self. I also still have some face paint. <laughs> okay, I see. You have disguise self. Men always been dragonborn like Boog. All right, what do you want to know? The corpse regards you lifelessly. Ooh, ooh. The corpse pauses, perhaps resisting the truth. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, nice. You have to speak the truth. I cannot lie. Uh, Ramazif, gone. Open for the taking. So he's just a squatter. He's less powerful than Roland. He doesn't even know whose house he's, uh, who the man was whose house he's squatting in. Magic repository. Suppository. <laughs> Boog sees now. He was always a silly bookman. Not even a good one. Indeed. And now he is mine. <laughs> jump onto the furniture this time. Oh yeah. And you know what? With slow fall, even if I miss, I won't fucking die from it. Indeed. I feel like I get the camera to actually agree with me. path interrupted. Right, and I can fly too. God damn it, I keep forgetting I can actually do that. I don't know why, but the camera's not letting me do this. Huh. It's very frustrating. Here's where it let me go. Isn't that lovely? I just like down on that bookcase. Step carefully. 
Moving out the main hall, removing Miranda's personal effects from my chambers. Placing such valuable tomes as the Annals of Carsis in the Carsis Vault for safekeeping at Al. If Mick Clark cannot handle such simple matters, I have to replace him with an animated armor or two. Uh. scrolls and books then <laughs> 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 again there are dozens of books though so security okay so not the one that says security below All right he won't miss just one book he's got a ton of them he, he especially won't miss the the book in his, like, top-secret fortified fucking vault. <laughs> right. There we go. This one. Okay. Above. Something Watch how you go. There's a trap. Boog. What? It's easy to disarm this. 15? You have a disarm? I've got yeah. traps in, or disarm traps in my inventory. Yeah, I got some. Oh no, that's bad. Mm. I rolled a nat 1. Mm. <laughs> no, we we're gonna, okay. we're gonna inspo that. Okay, that, that should be great. better. No, that's still one under. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. Get it? Yeah, what was in there? High security vault number one key. Oh. Yes. For the, yeah, the bank. <laughs> Sorry, I'm excited for when we do that. <laughs> uh, quick save. Okay. Okay, come on, big brain time, big brain time, we got this. Yeah, it's an at 20. Okay, cool. Nice. Okay, okay. All right, all right, quick save again. This is making me go off of my arcana proficiency, so... Okay. Yes! Dirty 20. <laughs> <laughs> Stop fucking touching my shit! Go away, Boog! I didn't even actually touch it! You are standing right here. You need to stop standing so close to me. I will push you <laughs> off the edge. One hundred percent will throw you off the edge. You may think I'm kidding. I am not. All right, somewhere around Step here, here there's a trap. Aha! Oh. Here we go. Oh, Boog. Boog, I like it down here. Ooh. Right tool to the trick. 
Oh, a 20. And I got it. Yeah. The Red Knight's final stratagem. This book has given off spooky red, uh, red vibes. Boog doesn't like this book. It's very red. Quite some valuable knowledge hidden between these pages. Divide and conquer. We read the Red Knight's final stratagem from Boog. I could read it. Well, it says we are I'm ready. Read it, Book. Read it. Hello. Okay, then. Well, see, there we go. <laughs> here you go, Boog. There's a whole bunch of locked chests down here if you want to open them. Okay, so one of these rooms. Yeah, this one. Yeah. There we go. I think this has the book oh, that look, you a can. Lamp. Was it just a lamp? Oh, okay. Touch One it, of these Luke. invisible walls has that Luke, book you it. can summon angels from. Luke, touch it. I touched it. You've arrived in the nick of time, saintly adventure. I've been trapped for so long, I dare say I'm half mad. <laughs> I've never seen this before. Thank you for sacrificing yourself to save me. Such courage brings a tear to the eye. So sacrificing myself. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> this glorious lamp is both an oasis and a prison. Someone must be inside at all times. But you were the first to breathe enough to take my Fun in there, Boog. I've never seen much. Toodles! Oh. Oh. A little genie ditty. If you were trapped in a magic lamp, wouldn't you like it a bit? It's tiny and stuffy and oily and damp, and you've had to be shrunk to fit. Sit here and ponder your only hope. Let some other fool will enter. Then you'll get out, but the entering dope will find there the new lamps re-enter. Re ah. Uh, Boog has, uh, Boog has made a mistake. There's yellow dye in here, though. Yeah. There's items I can pick up, so, <laughs> obviously, I can not trapped in here forever. Mmm, alcohol. Why did I drink that instead of just picking it up? Trapped in a in a thing. Uh, yes. Uh, but I see. Oh, oh no, that's a potion of flying. Damn, I thought that was a potion of speed. I see how the genie was entertaining himself. He's got a hookah in, hookah in here. Yeah. You know, you you could probably transfer to Carlac and pick up the lamp. Probably could, once I'm done, uh, grabbing everything in here. <laughs> Fair enough. I actually have literally no idea what to do to help you, so... <laughs> oh, he's got a lot Ooh, of fruit I found the here. Davis scroll! Mmm. I may be trapped inside of a genie's lamp, but at least I uh, won't get scurvy. Nice.
that is gold in here. That's pretty cool. As well as a lot of silver stuff. Which I'm yoinking. It's a potion of supreme healing. Nice. A couple of potions of greater healing. Superior healing. Okay, so hang on. I found the book and then I read the book. But it didn't give me the scroll. Oh, I found a scroll of summon closet. <laughs> if we hadn't already found a shovel. Uh, okay. Yeah. It's, uh... Okay, you found the caution before the Sealy book. Nice. I did, but it didn't give me the scroll. Uh, forget how we had to do this last time. Maybe you have to read it? Oh, wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> What'd you do? Uh, so I got out of the lamp. Oh, wait. Can I not actually pick up this fucking thing? Oh, wait. Nope. The moment I touch it, it sucks me in. I wonder then. Can you just hit square and then pick it up that way? That's what I was trying to do. Interesting. Ooh. Ooh, this is a pickle. <laughs> Target cannot be moved by force. Apparently. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh... Hmm. <laughs> what? I, I don't know. Can you read the books? Uh... I sent them to you. Okay. The Red Knight's Final Stratagem. The Red Knight was probably the most found. Uh, I was left from material plane after her ascension. And caution before the Sealy. Also, I see your present that you sent me earlier. What was it? Uh, was it a human heart still? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. I know how to do it. Okay, okay, okay. It actually gave me the solution while I was in there. Uh-huh. What? Wait. There we go. Uh, okay. And bada bingus. <laughs> We're all good now. <laughs> A sea closet. Yes. <laughs> so I read them both, but it doesn't seem like anything happened. Uh, have you?
I mean, you've got a lot of scrolls. Have you? Have I looked at every single scroll that was inventory and seen if I needed to learn it or not? Yes, I did that while you were looking at all of the stuff that you were doing inside of the wizard fucking lamp. Yes, that's exactly what I was doing the entire time. <laughs> Yeah, I knew it sounded like a silly question, but I figured I would ask anyways. But yeah, it hit me that it gave me a scroll of summon closet, which was weird. And I'm like, oh, oh no, I get how <laughs> I get how we get out of this. Okay, yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's uh, maybe we have to read them outside of the uh, library. Oh, well, there goes my only lockpick. have six lockpicks made oh, okay hey. yeah I know this because I'm looking at your inventory right now oh weird it says thieves tool times one though yeah if it keeps letting you activate your thieves tools you're fine okay opened it gems why does why does Carlac have it wait Carlac has it Carlac has the scroll I don't know I couldn't tell you she never once touched those books <laughs> Potions. Some healing stuff. I'm pretty sure that's it. Oh, did you already run through and grab everything else, like the Annals of Carsis and everything? No! Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. oh, no, I see what you mean. I have been waiting for you and trying to figure out this stupid fucking Fay book thing. Did you take it from her? Oh I yeah, there it I is. Did. Okay, yeah, Where? I see it. Where is it? Uh, it's Where in your it? inventory. It's cool. What's it next to? It is, uh, like the third scroll, uh, from the left on at the very top of your list of scrolls. Right next to animate dead. And bestow okay. curse. Thank you. No problem. My wizard level is too low. I can't learn it yet. Oh. Shoot. How close are we to leveling up? Oh, we're actually pretty close. Fairly close. That's curious. Oh, did you do all the things? No, asshole. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't... I appreciate it, but I wasn't expecting you to, uh... Stop and wait for me to figure out the the silly lamp thing. What was I supposed to do? Uh, you're exploring the vaults. I just figured you'd uh, run through and nab what you needed to. My dexterity is a plus one. 
I usually have the wizard for a reason, or not the wizard, but you know, the elf for a reason. Yeah. You know, to unlock everything. <laughs> And that's a that one. Come on, Boog. It's just a DC of 10. You can do this. There we go. Cool, I'm glad there's no traps in this room. <laughs> I didn't see anything. See, I can't see any traps anywhere. <laughs> Yeah, I can't remember which one's the right one. Abjuration Silver. Abjuration is over here. through a random door. <laughs> Found Carsis's vault. Yeah, that's because I'm in here about to open a thing. Also, Carsis's vault is the door that I had opened. Yeah. Uh, okay. That's the one where, you know, Carsis's crown, that's the one we want, that's the lever that I pulled, you know. 
that explains awesome. why the door was wide open. <laughs> yeah. Oh, nice. Hi. Hi. I picked up a whole bunch of uh, scrolls that you can take off me. <laughs> Good. Oh, There's the annals of Cursus. Hmm. Look on Netherese magic. Gale may like to know. Also... <laughs> Gale may like to know. <laughs> Another foe breaker. Huh. Weapon ignores bludgeon and resistance to damn. Carlac really already has that awesome fucking trident though. Yeah, but you can give it to Mithara or something. Yeah, you're right, I can't. Oh boog. Oh boog. Boog. Yeah? Look, I found it. <laughs> oh, Minster's vault. Look, I found it. Ooh. Ooh. Quickness hat, I'll just throw that to you. And a potion. <laughs> Ow, wait, hang on, boogie hurt. Oh, it stings. Ow, boog. Oh, it stung me. Oh, it stung. It looks like you're giving off a necrotic aura. <laughs> Look, it stung. It bit me. Ow. It bit me, Boog. Bit me. Bit me. Did you bite it back? Boog, Boog? finds this help sometimes. I was trying to throw it in an empty space to break it, and then your fire elemental's head got in the way. <laughs> I'm in okay. No. Boog knows that you command death, but you <laughs> seem to be. Min seems to be emanating death now.
good. I'm gonna charge you here with loitering, Boog. <laughs> That sounds hilarious. This watch has a short temper. Storm Shore Tabernacle. We should go talk to Shadowheart. Okay. I feel very gross. Everything <laughs> burns. Everything burns, Boo. Everything burns. One second. Bless you. Okay. All right, Boo, watch this. You ready? Okay. The Boo is ready. Okay, great. I am currently cursed. There we go. Ah, oh, yes. This is much better. Okay. Oh. Boogas also had scrolls of remove curse. Sites co codexes enervating magic. Also, what does the book say? Pages are covered in esoteric symbols and strange runes, some indecipherable but some strangely familiar. Eyes are drawn to one page, describing a long lost book. Nick man, see it day. These are secrets of life and death known only to the Red Wizards. Committing such secrets to parchment is a risk they are loath to take, lest unworthy gaze upon them. Who better then to guard their secrets than the spirits... Hang on. Than the spirits of the jealous did themselves. To look hmm. upon the necromancy of Thais to risk madness at the hands of the spirits. But the wise traveler who can tread the line between life and death will find knowledge witnessed by precious few mortals. The rest of the entry details the precautions and risks associated with reading the text, but lays out a clear path to unraveling the secrets contained in this tome. <gasps> Read it. <laughs> ooh, ooh. The book radiates power. Oh my the god. You read Boo, the save. Echo in your mind. Oh, yeah. Min is opening the spooky book again. And Asterion is here for some reason. Right? <laughs> Would be enough? Ooh. The dirty 20. Nice. As you pass the strange glyphs, you can feel the book resisting. Oh Gusty no, you don't. Voices whisper at you from the dark, probing and fighting your <laughs> Min, mind. why are you smiling? <laughs> but your will is iron, and you brush past these shades of the past. Are the dark shadows on your, un underneath your eyes actually spreading down further towards your cheeks now? Life and death are malleable as clay to be bent what? No. shaped by your will. By your power. But as you close the book, a nagging doubt whispers in your mind. What consequences will there be for calling the dead from their rest? That is fine. Three oh, journal also, updates I'm invisible available. now. <laughs> I have three journal updates av available now from that. Also, now I'm invisible. When I first met you, oh, you're saving fine. yourself from ceremonies was I'm your greatest to wish. And yet now, you've stepped closer to embracing it. 
I trust your leadership and respect your decisions. But I truly hope this is not something we come to regret. Oh, apparently that was the final update for the book. Did you get the dance macabre? I've been unfair to you. Yeah. Honestly, yeah, I did. You surpassed nice. even those. <laughs> Seemed to... Hey, Boog. Yes, man. I can make more friends now. Oh no. I mean. Don't worry, Boog. Boo gets overjoyed at this news. So happy to have more friends. Like Steven. <laughs> no, don't worry, Boo. It'll be fine. It'll probably be more friends like, um... Like, uh... Shovel. <laughs> I know you like shovel, right? Hey, uh, <laughs> looks like Gail wants to talk to somebody. Yeah, because we found the book. Oh, I, yeah, that's true. Hey, want to play pretend? You and me. Let's imagine. I get to Do I not have... An updated weeks. conversation with we Shovel now? Why is Shovel stuck? Ahead of us. What do we do? Mm -hmm. Boo, go talk to Shovel. When you have a chance. Hold on a second, I'm having a really sweet conversation with uh, Carlac. Oh, okay. Yes, the Annals of Carsis. <sighs> we can dream, soldier. But the thing about dreams is they aren't real. Anyway, either one of us could drop dead tomorrow for any reason at all. No moment is guaranteed. Except this one. And this one. And maybe this one too. I have no less than anyone Here else. Here you go. I guarantee Oh, you no, Min. <sighs> Damn it. I wish I had a longer road ahead of me. Mm. I want to walk it with you. I'm not really mm. tough enough to face any of this, you know. Oh no, Min! Oh I'm Min! Shitless. But there's a courage in me I never knew I had. I've always thought I was fearless. Never scared of a fight, of oh. the future. But dying has taught me so much. There's no courage in fearlessness. There's courage in being fucking terrified, but still going forward. Still being grateful. Still trying. We're going to save this city together. It's going to be the last thing I do. That's why I know we're going to win. Let's get busy with it. I've got the rest of my life ahead of me and a lot to do before I go. Hell yeah, Carlac. Oh, hey. Dollar store fucking Gandalf's here again. Elminster? No yeah. Talk, I'm afraid. Yeah, don't talk to him yet. We're talking Shit. to Gale. <laughs> God fucking damn it, really? It's okay, he doesn't want to talk to me, so that's fine. The book states that the crown and nether stones were originally one construct, seemingly sundered at the moment yeah, it's almost like I'm having a conversation downfall. with Gale about, the, the, you know, the, the crown, crown or whatever. And the three right. Stones, and with the correct <sighs> invocation of certain spells and gestures detailed in these notes. I think I could reforge it to every end you can imagine, and a thousand more beyond. Just think of it. The power of the gods in mortal hands a screenshot at last of what Min's face would be looks free like. of doctrine. <laughs> Confined Certain only lighting. by the limits of our imaginations. It looks totally fine. I Very can healthy. see it. <laughs> It's definitely in her cheekbones now. Yeah.
Yeah, the darkness is know. spreading down your face. Ao does not look kindly on God meddling in mortal affairs. She may have no choice but to stand by and let events unfold. Even oh. with the fate of the world at stake, she had little more to offer me than the means of blowing myself up at a more convenient time. She's done nothing to help us. Mistra wanted the brain obliterated because of this crown. She fears a world in which such power is beyond her control, ready to be claimed by Carsus's successor. They deserve to be challenged. Perhaps you and I deserve better than to live and die as their pawns. <laughs> Ambition is not <laughs> sin. <laughs> to question the powers that rule us is not treason. We must at least try. Why wallow in the dirt when we can reach for the stars? I mean, there's nothing wrong with a little dirt, but I can't do it. <laughs> The wizard answer. No, oh, I know, right? I'm glad you can recognize this for the opportunity it is. Nevertheless, not a step to take lightly. It's our future that I'm. You're the one who said not a step to take lightly. Can't rely on anyone else to do it for us. <laughs> for now, we've learned all we can. Whatever comes of this, we cannot allow the crown to be reforged in Raphael's image. Oh, a devil not. wielding the might of Cassus. It would be the end of everything. Hello, grandfather. We are wearing yeah, the same my friend. you and I. I've just been eating cheese oh, no, while hanging out. No, don't mind me. I'm just enjoying a lungful of bull terrier now. Have you tried the uh, soup? It's delicious. It's <laughs> not one worthy of bottling. I hear you've been browsing in the most esteemed of emporiums, sorcerous sundries. Uh, yes, my it curiosity. was very much gale. <laughs> I don't seem surprised to see Gale's alive. I trusted I'm literally wearing his clothes. This is great. <laughs> to seek the truth. By now, you are aware of the evil we are up against. I stole your clothes, old man, and I made a copy of the very tool with which its eponymous creator unmade an empire and magic itself. Perhaps now you understand what is at stake here, my boy. Though what Mr. asked of you was extreme, it was not without merit, nor demanded lightly. What are you saying? Or rather, what are you not saying? Mr. knows you defied her, Gail. Well, of course she knows. She's Mr. She bids you come to her holy shrine in the Stormshore Tabernacle. There, she will grant you an audience at last. Oh my god, Gail, we need to get you dressed up for that. Okay, we got that. I got an extra wizard outfit. Definitely <laughs> didn't steal it off of a guy whose bones are in our entryway. <laughs> um, don't worry about that. Oh, so, Aelin says hi. Miss she knows <clears throat> what I see in you, just as I know what she sees in you. I was not Ooh, I have born an old man. I know all too well what it's like to have a goddess fill your heart with longing. You sure about that, old Looking man? Looking at you is <laughs> like gazing into a mirror. Yeah, pretty sure I played Baldur's Gate one at least a little bit, and he was still old even in that game. Is the past. Future is, well, 
Still to be decided. By me. Not by Mistra. If there is another way, I trust you can find it. It is not in your nature, nor mine, to stop looking. To accept the first answer to any dilemma. Do what you can. Put that mind to work. Trust in yourself. Trust in the... It's just like, okay, are we, we, I guess we're having an awkward steering uh, contest now. There is a conclusion yet to be written in this sorry tale, Gale of Waterdeep. And yours is the quill that will write it. Conjure of cheap tricks. So all it took to get Mistress' attention was to learn how to reforge an artifact that once destroyed her. It's obvious when you stop to think about it. I mean, yeah. There was her answer to this. No? Okay. <laughs> not scared, not yet. But she's shaken. If she feels the need to intervene directly. This is a conversation that's long overdue on both sides. <laughs> I owe it to her to hear her out. Then you look fantastic. Look, <laughs> look healthy and hale and hearty. <laughs> Were your lips always that dark color? From the heavens is waiting. Uh, I I darkened them recently. Remember for Gortash's oh, party? Okay, gotcha. Cause it was his fancy up, you know, his fancy soiree or whatever. So I changed up my hair and my makeup a little. <laughs> I, I didn't like you... do much else though. <laughs> Got anything to say about Gail's granddad being here again? I couldn't help. Can I put the book away yet? Said to Gale. <gasps> Every day a god oh, asks nope, for a it chat. reappeared in my inventory. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I'm invited too. <laughs> okay, that's always <laughs> there now. I wondered if, like, you know, if I sent it to my, in like, the camp, if it would go away. Nope, it's, it's <laughs> forever bound. Not really all that upset it's just kind of hilarious <laughs> right not the, the book is yours colors. whether you want it or not yeah i mean that's an okay color combination the scarlet and white pretty but eh. not terrible yeah not terrible, but not great. Right. Uh. Well, I had the bloody plum before. Let's see if the bloody plum will... I kind of like it. Where are you? Oh, sorry. Ran there back you are. over this way. Uh, uh, yeah. Not too bad. Not bad. Deep blue with a red sash. Works well. It's like a purple blue again. It's the bloody plum one again. Gotcha. Hello, shovel. Okay. Your mind tingles as it opens to work. <laughs> 
Do you think? Do you not think to be an abomination yet, Halson? <laughs> Curse that rotten devil and her full tongue, trying to set Eltan against me. She's a damnable inferno of chaos. What matters now is that Eltan saw sense, and we know our path forward. We'll finish what my father couldn't. We'll awaken Ansur, the heart of the gate. Go on, read the legend of Ansur. Then we can plan our next steps. Ah, <laughs> oh, yay. Okay, good. <laughs> there wasn't a romance dialogue option for a little bit there, and I was starting to panic. <laughs> I was like, no. Was it the skeletons? Was it the bone men? <laughs> no, I just wanted to make sure that that was... Making sure that, you know, you weren't going to kick me to the curb for one accidental mistake, too. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> Did you figure out what I sent you yet? Uh, I think I already had the human heart. Mm -hmm. Uh, let me see here. I have a stuffed owl bear toy. Don't know where that came from. and you don't know where it came from. The owl bear toy? Uh-huh. That's actually kind of nice of you. <laughs> Thanks, Min. Yeah I... yeah, I saw it and thought of you. God. If I ever send you something like that, then... <laughs> Hey, Aelin's back for the moment. Aelin! Oh! And Isabella's here. Yep. Aelin seems a little subdued since you came back. Did something happen? A little on, like, you should have seen her before. Well, I mean, she everything. folded Larroquin like he was a fucking folding chair. Oh, how she glowed. Yeah, Literally. <laughs> the years, the decades, the, the century have taken their toll. She's seen more hurt than we can dream of. She needs cherishing now. And I'm up for the task. Thank you for fighting by her side. It means more to her, to me, than you know. Ah. Uh. Ally mine, we are reunited. I was just regaling sweet Isabel with tales of our prowess. Very impressive. Thank you for helping Aelin. That wizard sounded absolutely dastardly. Eh, he was a dick. <laughs> he absolutely had it coming. He did, and it came. Now, my friend, bask in your victory. I will do the same. My darling, we must inform our friend of our news. Indeed. I've scouted a Salunite enclave outside the city. 
They faced the Absolute's armies and come out battered and bruised. Aelin and I will go to them, provide what help we can. But fear not. When the time comes for you to face the oh, foe, oh yeah, did you see Bob Newhart pass away? And I will stand oh no, I did not. We wouldn't miss it, not for anything. Go Ninety-four well, years old, though. We will see you Damn. soon. Damn. And with our great At least you lived a full life. This city will be exactly. saved. Like on one hand, it was really sad, but on the other hand, that was lot mm -hmm. <laughs> I love that Aelin's Stop flapping her wings. Stop judging the NPCs. I'm sorry, it's just... It's like a goose trying to be intimidating, just... <laughs> Yeah. Boo, Gelminster's 13 centuries old. Now, but he's like a human. I have a few more days in your company. Is he though? No. Are you sure about that, Boog? I actually am not. I'm pretty sure he's a human. But uh yeah. <laughs> I guess he's just Mistra's favorite Gandalf clone. about large animals those have been struck down but perhaps it is wise not to push our luck this time <laughs> scratch's tongue lolls out happily his tail wagging even faster What do you have to say about everything that's been happening so far, Mansara? With Elminster's ludicrous plan, destroying the Absolute before we fully understand it would be madness. <clears throat> She's like, we cannot allow Gale to go through with Elminster's ludicrous plan. Destroying the Absolute before we fully understand it would be madness! We need a favor and alliance with Gorkash. He is the only authority figure in Baldur's Gate worth a damn. Even as the Elder Brain tears at the foundations of the city, he stands strong and looks for solutions. Better for us to be a solution rather than a problem for his steel watch to scrape off the street. It would be wise to return to him and pledge an oath of allegiance before he declares us enemies of the peace. <laughs> I 
Uh, what's your thoughts on Graphic Hold Deal? Yeah. His hands any more than a god. I say we put the devil from our minds and trust in ourselves. If anyone should have the power of the crown, it should be. How does us. she feel about Raphael's deal? Uh, she thinks that it's uh, dumb to trust the devil and that we should have the power of the crown, not him. <laughs> also, I've changed clothes again. Seems. And now you're wearing Jahira's clothes. But yeah, she's all for uh, allying with Gortash because he's he's a problem solver. He's uh, the only authority figure worth a damn, I guess. Mm. Oh, and now I'm naked. Oh, that is how that works. Okay, good to know. Now Boogle goes streaking. Uh... <laughs> You have right. to dress yourself. I uh, you forgot there's a child here. I best uh, cover my shame. Mm. There you go, Boog. Have some clothes. Yes, I don't. Oh, you gave me the collar. <laughs> Better than nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Homely clothes. Just pants. Yeah, that's the starter clothes, Boo. Uh, oh yeah, that's right, I forgot. I didn't have a shirt originally. <laughs> no, you didn't! <laughs> Fucking bitching at me for shit! <laughs> no, what are you call well, you didn't even start with a shirt, my dude! <laughs> You had your shiny ass pecs out and everything better. <laughs> I'd spent so long being civilized and wearing shirts that I'd, I'd forgotten how it feels to let my nips breathe. <laughs> Forgot your true origins. <laughs> Uh -oh. But the wicked don't. Oh, is this when so they come for us? Oh, yeah. The unrest. Get the hells away from me! Ah, uh, okay. Well, I guess I know what we're doing tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Peace, brother. We're here to take you home. The master needs all seven of us for the ceremony. Come with us and be reborn. We'll live again. The right. The master needs him. He must attend. What a lovely invitation. But I'm afraid I'll have to decline. I intend to kill him, you see. We will live again, Astarian. The scars on our backs are sealed with the cruelest power. Oh nice, I'm equipped to Shadowheart. Seven sigils. Your number seven. Oh yeah, <laughs> you are. <laughs> <laughs> For the Black Mass. Our fates were sealed in his writing long ago. A promise to his favorite spawn, fulfilled in the crypt beneath his palace. This is our only chance to be free, to end centuries of slavery. You will not ruin it, Astorian. Boog oh, is going up. to punch you with the power of the sun. Or someone did. At least somebody leveled up. Oh, Shadowheart is dead last. Is that a halfling? Is that a gnome? Oh, sh what are you? Oh no, everyone. That's a fucking gnome! <laughs> Boog! 
That vampire spot is a gnome. <laughs> Eliminate him. He looks ridiculous. Are you throwing titty lights at him? I was throwing the 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 trident at them. See what Asterion did? What'd he do? He drank a potion of feather fall. Of course he did. Not like he has an entire inventory full of so many other things. I shit you not, you can go back into the battle log. Why? Uh, Asterion Why lost condition to wild there? magic teleport, and then Asterion used potion of feather fall. Question Why is there darkness over there? Uh, I do not know. Wait, let me look at the combat log. Who cast darkness? Asterion used arrow of darkness. Well, I mean, it makes it so that he can't be seen. So... True. Good for him. <laughs> I guess. Well, that wasn't supposed to be that. That was supposed to be, uh, the other bomb, but that's okay. Sorry I ruined your plans, Astarian. <laughs> Whatever plans they were supposed to be. <laughs> I always feel like that was that would be something that Carlac would one hundred percent do is if she got bit she'd bite them back. Right. Oh, you know what? It's times like this I not really, but I slightly wish we hadn't uh Stabilized her infernal engine because they'd get take fire damage from biting her. Hi, I hope you like that. <laughs> think that you know we're only dealing with these few spawn here because all of our other allies are dealing with the rest of the spawn yeah that makes sense Just, you know story wise right yeah Handy. you guys get a flump <laughs> you just run into someone up 
bombed, didn't you? <laughs> it's okay if you did. I'm not here to judge you if that's the, you know, case, because that is the thing that I would do. Damn it, Boog. Oh, what? Oh, do you need me to move? No. No, All it's right. too late. I mean, it's not. I could still move. No, no, no. It's too late. Oh, they count as humanoids. Or they don't count as humanoids. Oh, <gasps> wait a minute. They count... They don't count as humanoids. Ray! They yeah. don't count as humanoids! <laughs> That's gonna make the fight with Kazador so much fun! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god! <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> I I'm see. very normal about this. <laughs> Just, you know... <laughs> when you give a necromancer a cookie... <laughs> if, if you give the necromancer a cookie and tell her that she can do things like <laughs> you know command undead to grovel oh okay i see what you're talking about now and stuff <laughs> you know makes it really fun for the necromancer right <laughs> Yeah. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> why, why you, you know, the undead shouldn't fuck with the necromancers, right? <laughs> right. Man, Astarian should have stayed with me. What a shame. <laughs> I could have kept him safe, but no. <laughs> What a shame. Oh well. This needs to end. One way. Or another. They mentioned my scars and are right. I need to get to that crypt and find out what these damn markings are really for. Yeah, right? Carlac? <laughs> <laughs> nice tits. I bit one of their brains. <laughs> <laughs> I bet Carlock's gonna be real pissed. <laughs> Similar to Marvel Sedaptability, spell slots charges and similar resource costs for you. Your next action is to removed. 
Precious after a long rest. Oh, I see. That's another additional, like, action I can give myself. I dare Kazador to send more lackeys our way. This is our territory. I'll crack anyone who tries to come into my house and hurt my people. Damn, yeah, I got you, Karlak. This is our house. We won't allow anybody to take that shit from us. Zora wants to talk. Not the kind of excitement I usually enjoy being woken up for. Still, better than not waking up at all. Or waking up as something else entirely. Or waking up as something else entirely. <laughs> uh say take Gil to talk to Mistra and then end for the night. Yeah, we can do that. Grab the wizard then. Hey, Let me check. Bitch. You being horny, Ms. Uh, Missouri? Little Will's all grown up. I can't wait Don't say to it. see what Don't trouble say it. he gets into. <laughs> Thank you for not saying it. I would have had to have disowned you. Yes. Impossible. My bargain right. was uncommonly reasonable. A single soul well, for the return of Baldur's Gate's most beloved duke. A real poor bargain, I should untouched think. Gale. I never thought <laughs> that Shadri Blade of Frontiers would surrender his father for freedom. Not very valorous, if you ask me. But what does a mean old devil like me know about heroes? Nah, Mazora's just taking the chance to stick more barbs into fucking Will. My closet still exists. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. That's how familiars work. Gotcha. Oh well, he'll be forever safe inside that lamp. <laughs> I'm gonna use the yellow dye on his on his outfit. What do you think? That yellow dye that you found? Yeah. I'm gonna uh, use it on Gail's outfit, what do you think? Go for it. I think anything's better than that. Kind of black and white. Oh god, it's hideous and I love it. Yeah. Oh, it's so terrible, it's like mustard. Ugh. Yeah, I might have been wrong. <laughs> Perfect. Maybe the, like, grayish black and white wasn't so bad. <laughs> also, you can, like, ungroup and dismiss your familiar, by the way. <laughs> the closet's just like, where the, the fuck am I? <laughs> okay. No, oh, Shovel doesn't want to talk to me anymore. No, no. Mistress like. Alright, Ray, I'm waiting for you. Okay, oh, I'm on are. my way. Okay, here I am. I'm sorry I touched your fire. God. <laughs> Hi. Alright, Gail. Set 
shoot here. No. There she stands, just as Elminster promised. Mistra, goddess of the weave, mother of all magic. The old man wasn't lying. Goddess of She's boobs. Gail's right. Most goddesses are like that the boob. <laughs> As though the weave itself were coursing beneath her stony skin. A stream of pure, undiluted weave. I only have to reach out, and it will carry me to Mistra, wherever she may be. Time was, I'd have given my right arm for a chance to speak with Mistra again. <laughs> the left one, too. Maybe a knee. so much as a fingernail she just you to blow yourself up mm, not the message one hopes to receive from a past lover but her first love was always the weave the best i was a close second when i pictured this moment i thought i'd feel more in control yeah here i am with palms sweatier than a bugbear's armpit i always wonder what being nervous would feel like i hate it During my time locked away in Waterdeep, I prepared a quite comprehensive speech for her on the subject of our former relationship and the mm -hmm. manner in which it ended. Alas, recent events have rendered the majority of it moot, so I'm going to have to improvise. Unless you have any words of wisdom to impart before I go. her squirm <laughs> you'd make a fine three dragon anti player you know i think it's I keep best forgetting I that cool he tells me that every time because i'm just like particularly high risk round of three dragon <laughs> it's like yeah i do i'll let mistress show her fight <laughs> and then i can see how strong a chance we stand of winning the gambit i'll only be gone for a matter of moments the outer planes experience time quite differently to our own wait for me please All right, well, Boog, we stand around while he goes talks to the booby lady. Mm. Boog oh, wishes he could see the booby lady. <laughs> As do you. But I assume we're not here solely to exchange compliments. So why am I here? You discovered what lies at the heart of the Absolute, the Crown of Causes. And you disobeyed my instruction. Why? Because you had no right to ask that of me. You cast me out. Remember? You were my lover. My chosen. Yet still you know so little of me. The past cannot be undone with self-pity. Nor can a future be forged. Only with the truth will you see the way ahead. The fragment of magic you tried to return to me was not of my creation. It was the Carsite Weave. It is a corrupted, half-born magic wrought in the brief moment Carsus ascended to godhood. It hungers for power, just as he did, and it can never be sated. You unleashed something that would consume all magic in existence, and yet you thought only of preserving yourself. So that's what you're scared of. With the Whoa. crown of Carsus reforged, I could take control of the Carsite Weave. You can no more control the Carsite Weave than a weather vane could control a storm. That it entered your body and consumed no more than your powers was a miracle. But we will not be granted another. 
The only reason the orb sleeps is because Luke. I have allowed it to feed yeah. on the truth. Luke. Yes, man. Temporary measure. But Miracles aren't real. <laughs> With each day that passes, the elder scales powerful and strong. A new kind of God. Its worshippers also a scourge of soulless illithids. Think I could steal her outfit. If you outfit. will not use the orb to end this abomination, then you must find a way to separate uh. crown and host. When you've done Good this, thing, so we would have to travel to where she is which may be hard if she does not want us to find her she's on the ethereal plane so be it follow the needle who does not know a way to get there how truly it leads you i do oh. follow gail's dick <laughs> oh hey gail you're back What's up, dude? My man? <laughs> How was it with the goddess? Gail, can your dick divine a way to the astral plane? <laughs> or the ethereal plane? Gail, you're shaking. You're excited. Oh. The car sight weave. I had no idea. Do you realize what this means? The orb is no stray piece of ordinary magic. It is something entirely okay, I think different. He's excited. The nascent form <laughs> of a new divine power. Of course, I couldn't control it. I was more killing enough power to destroy a city. Once I reforge the crown, the power of a god will be mine to command. Slim to none, I hope. Mistra has no right to prevent another ascending to the Pantheon. Only Ao can decide that. Let me assure you, mm. Karsai Weave has no more inherent evil to it than a, a child in the womb, or an axe half forged on the blacksmith's anvil. It is a tool. Ready to be shaped by its wielder. By me. And you know me to be someone of reasonably sound moral judgment, don't you? I. Uh, <coughs> Boop yeah, is not yes. entirely certain. <laughs> Morals be damned. You must take it. Gods, it's refreshing to share the company of someone <laughs> who sees things the same way I do. Always yes, Gale! And, and now Boog is even is less exactly certain of it that he's morally sound. After that. <laughs> yes! Yes, Gale! Min is the perfect person <laughs> for this. Is he an altar right, Boog? To Tyr? Uh, yeah, yeah. Tyr, the blind <laughs> god, Boog, what are you doing? To all. I'm Innocent looking at the other god statues. The law dictates ah. what is right. Boog Be staring at other god titties. <laughs> Your knowledge of religion is My God, look at Tears Nips. <laughs> he does have some pretty mighty nips. It's true. Making making off. Uh oh, Boog. Would uh would Tyr want some booze? Probably. The offering is accepted, but more evidence of oh. devotion is required. I would need to donate more. <laughs> oh, Boog. Counselor Floric is set to be executed. Oh, ah, the world is vibrating, Boog. Your offering is accepted, but more evidence of devotion yeah. is required. How much more do you need of me? God damn. Oh my god. Boo, guy from the cabbages guy. Oh, oh, yeah, one second, one second. Your offering is accepted, but more evidence. You know what, Tyr, you're, you're just a little too greedy.
This way. Okay. <laughs> it's obvious, isn't it? To placate us. To keep us all nice. There he is. Right there. Oh yeah, there he is. Do you know how hard it is to get those cabbages in two? Wait. The stoic starts. Calming presence. You one of those monastic types. Stay clear of my cabbages. You're sort of done enough damage as it is. <laughs> And thus, you have your Avatar The Last Airbender moment. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Shouldn't go wandering in dark. On the half orc's finger, you notice an unusual ring. Heavy, and with a strange <laughs> symbol carved on its surface. Scary white goo book. It's not that you noticed the, what was on the ring, you're just like, ooh, ring, shiny. You can call on crates marked for Nine Fingers Keen, leader of the guild. The thug works for Min. <laughs> Min, uh, Min, no. Stop staring. Start walking. Last <laughs> chance. Uh, quick step for me? Okay. This is the only thing I have bonus to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. All good. Bloody dark old sense. Getting paid to lurk in our guild hall. Never work for it. Guarding the secret entrance. Not good enough for them, but good enough for poor old Tuskrun. I just detected his thoughts. What? Another one come to take our coin and clog our halls. Fine, I'll show you in. Nine fingers will give you orders. Paul Boog. <laughs> Before I change my mind. Boog, I'm a spy now! <laughs> oh my god, Boog, I'm an amazing spy. Hang on, I gotta go get Jahira and tell her and bring her back. I gotta go tell Jahira that I'm a spy. Don't move. <laughs> you stay there! Ooh, I think we're like... One decent conversation uh, worth of experience away from leveling up. Boog, I told you. Don't move. You don't fucking move. You understand me, Boog? You stay right there. Stay right there, Boog. I see you moving, Boog. <laughs> Boog, you know the consequences of doing things like that. Oh. Boog is sorry. Better be. Okay, come on. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it's Maul! <laughs> oh, like I said, there it is. <laughs> wow, look who it is! Glad to see you in the city. Ready to do some business? You're alive! Oh, I've got a few ideas. And you have both eyes. Place in no time. Let's see, you got gold stuff wrapped around one of your horns. Ready to do some business? I survived the hells when Elturel fell. 
Compared to that, slipping out of Moonrise was child's play. Sure is. We work for Fetcher, handling what you might call pre-owned goods. Talk to Sticky. He'll cut you a deal. Sticky? Sticky. Sticky. <laughs> Isn't himself, so I'm running the shop. You buying or selling? Boog, this child's name is Sticky. <laughs> Parents Question give their Boog. children odd names, it seems. It's tranquility. Oh, ooh. <laughs> Long rests now surround me with an aura of peace, granting me sanctuary. Which means Sounds nobody cool. can target me until I'm ready to actually attack them. Nice. That sounds quite exciting, Boo. Ooh, and uh Carlac just received her like don't die passive, basically. Very nice. Relentless rage. E. Yeah. Alright, kid, you want some wow, really interesting great. stuff? Glad to see you in the city. Ready to do some business? Sure is. We work. Hey, Boog, what kind of stuff you think I should give this kid? Uh. Well. If Boog had to guess. And he's not always good at that. Uh, Boog thinks they deal in stolen property. Which probably works for the best because uh, Boog and Min tend to have a lot of stolen property. Reason. I don't know why I suddenly went stealth. Ain't <laughs> hey, me neither. This kid's name is Happy for some Hands. Stealthing, and then I suddenly wasn't, and that was really <laughs> weird. Like, I felt myself go stealth mode and then unstealth. So. Huh. Yeah, I mean, you did. I didn't know that was unintentional. Yeah, that was weird. Guys, the name is the professor. Are you smart? Right. Which crew are you with? A bit Bell of a breakers, rude question, Boo. The children of Hall. The names ring familiar. Two of the many crews that His name is the, the professor. A loose collective with Boog must know if he is smart, like a professor. I think that's why he's called the professor, Boo. <laughs> hey, I look like Elminster. Boog, I look like Elminster now. <laughs> I am Elminster colored. <laughs> Hello? I'm trying to lie to a guy? Yeah, there we go. Can't say I've heard of you. Spare me the story behind the name. I'm Boog, sure it's done? very scary. <laughs> I lied to Failing. the professor. He asked me what, uh, what, uh, guild team I'm from, and I made up one, and he believed me. I told him our guild, our guild sect was called the Worm Skulls. The latest challenger to the guild's position. But probably the first so one he sounds like the guy who hit you with the, he with came the out stick. Of nowhere and ate <laughs> our turf in a ten day. So if you're speaking to the guild master, maybe step soft. Oh, he kind of does. I have some stuff to sell too. Victor isn't himself, so I'm running the shop. You buying? Oh, Boog, there's a guy who sells booze. Ooh.
Yes, yes. Boog, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hang on. Let's go. Let me sell my stuff. Let's go. Boog, let's go. There are other people to sell your stuff to. Also, I am getting sleepy and I do not want to do the snoring sleepies on your stream like somebody does. That would be super socially awkward. Okay. I got what I wanted. I bought a potion of speed off of him. If it's ooped. Let's go, let's go. Also, Boog. Boog, look. I look like the old man. <laughs> <laughs> also, I look a little bit like you. Uh, look. Wait. Oh, oh I need to level up. Yeah. You and Jahira can level up. You were shaking so long that I forgot I needed to level up as well. <laughs> wow. Wow, Boog. <laughs> He just make it all my fault. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Raise a corpse as a heinous mummy that fight all along by my side. Nice. I was about to ask what really cool fucking thing you got at level 11. Oh, that was just one of my regular spells as a wizard. Oh, okay. I didn't look at the really cool thing that I got. Oh, that reminds me though, I need to see if I can... Uh, my inventory rearranged. I can summon the Deva now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, I have... Hmm. Dude, you can summon so many fucking friends now. <laughs> yeah. You have skeletons, your winged horrors, ghouls, the fucking... The ripped yeah. angel man. At the, uh, the big brain fight at the end, if you want, you can take in, uh, few allies. <laughs> like, uh... <laughs> When I, when, you know, you were Frankie. Yeah. You can take in two people if you want. <laughs> so you can do all sorts of, you, so you can do all the things. I'm not that worried about it. It's an awful I'll let you have the big army this time. Well, no, that's what I'm saying, like, I will have the big army and then you can have, like, the two allies. We should withdraw oh, okay. protection, at the very least. And cede more ground to the Stone Lord. You're not suggesting I yield a single inch of the city, my city, to this cult. I. We already look weak. If you're seen to be forgiving debts. I didn't say forgive. Seize the building. Arm any children old enough. If they protect what's mine, we'll consider that a start on what's owed. Yes, Guildmaster. I... Excuse me. This is a private council. Keep your underpants clean. And I'm Star. here. We're playing host to a hero. <laughs> you owe me a gold piece, Grandmother. When I heard you died out in the wilderness, I made an offering at Kalimvor's well. Of gold? Oh, I did not know I meant so much to you, Guildmaster. I'm terribly sentimental. Case in point, I've just let a harper walk through my guild hall, noticeably unholed. Because I'm curious about why you're here and who it is you've brought with you. Hi, my name is Min. <laughs> I make friends. How nice. You won't <laughs> find many of those in my guild hall. <laughs> We won't pass your hospitality too long, my Jahira approves. I'm searching for a of Russian. A big Hi, my name is Min. I'm a friend of Jahira's. Such information does not come cheap, High Harper. Not in normal my times. My stick is, like, right there. 
Because I'm too short. We're all such good friends. I'll do better than tell you where he is. I'm bringing him here as we speak. Or parts of him, at least. I gave no orders about the condition of his corpse. What treachery is this, Nine Fingers? Have you thrown in with the Absolute too? Against my own city? Careful. You're in very real danger of hurting my feelings. It's Minsk who's found his face. so many different noises. God. I hope none of and them came over to the microphone. I didn't hear anything, honestly. Lies. Oh, God. Uh. It should. My people speak it in the same breath as Saravok and Demogorgon. But he's just another upstart. In his short reign, the Stone Lord and his crew have earned a reputation. Pure brutality. No I don't want to say short like an insult, boo. And where he moves <laughs> my people down, this ripe little cult takes root. But not for much longer. We have word on where he plans to hit next. And he'll find us ready to hit back this time. Nine fingers. Estelle. Call off your ambush. Tell us where Estelle. he is. Estelle. We'll handle this. We. I heard what happened to your harpers, Jahira. Book, do you think I'm they sorry, were an item before? This fight's too big for you alone. Mm. She knows her first name, Book. Book is unsure. If you're half the friend you're posing as, you'll tell her that her. But Estelle is, is a nicer name than Nine Still Fingers. Lord's fate is sealed. She only has we nine have a fingers. To fight. I'd rather turn our talk to that, but if you need a moment, Jahira, well, you've earned that much. My guild hall is open to you. Have a drink, well, Jahira. Boog is covered in scales, but he is Just not called well Scaly enough. Scales. He's called Boog. You are Scaly Boy Boog. Keep the Harper out of trouble. Just because I don't want to kill her doesn't mean I won't. Beyond that, be welcome. Be merry. Is there something you require of a uh, yes. Remington oh. rats? Did you enjoy the encounter? I think they enjoyed it. I have no doubt you gave them a good talking to. The rats yeah, usually put the lid on their nasty emotions. <laughs> the Stone Lord business distracting me. Some are starting to test the leash. All the more reason to be rid of the cult quickly. So I can remind my crews it's not a leash round their necks if they cross me. Boog wants to be clear that we left them alive. Boog thinks anyways. Did we? We did actually trigger... <laughs> Do non lethal attacks and we knocked them all out. That's all right. Let's see. Boog, would you like to talk to her while I keep you here distracted? Yeah. You keep good company, but you don't do the you thing like the, the calling off the ambush and all that. Or getting At the rise of General Kethrick Thorm, chosen of Merkel, unkillable tyrant of Moonrise. And I hear you. This boot can try to talk to her. And when we're sitting in your stronghold, I'll give a good slippery shite about what you want. You're with the Harper, so you already know there's a war coming. And I already know the only thing about you that I need to. You've crossed paths with the cult's leadership before, and you're still standing. I mean to burn the Absolute from the face of my city. So if you mean to help, congratulations. We just became the best of friends. Ooh, Min. Boog just made a, real, uh, a best friend. Oh my god, Boog. Nice. <laughs> No begging. Not even a snotty little please. <laughs> it's almost like you don't know who you're talking to. The order's been given. 
Oh, Boog, he has drugs. <laughs> oh my god, Boog, he also has coffee. <laughs> Knowing what I know usually comes at a cost. I take it neither of those intrigue you. What drugs and coffee? I think it's interesting. We don't. The Zentarim work for live a very boring life, Book. Time was I charged <laughs> the bastards double if I let them into my hall at all, but times change. The guild is many things, but it's not an army. Boog tries not to poison his body with anything other than, well, the poison that runs through Boog's body. <laughs> hmm. I'm immune to charms over the years. Not seen this face. Trying to steer the city, just not always in the same direction. Oh, can't stand harpers as a rule, but Jir is the exception. She's only really half a harper at most. The same way I'm not just the lowly thief, vagabond, and murderer the watch and peers would paint me as. I happen to be a fine singer, too. <laughs> Hello, Jack. <laughs> he comes walking in, delicately Simply places enough. a hedgehog upon the floor, After and he continues walking to the door. I went and listened to the with the details. How I found evidence of Gortash's projects, traced him to Orin. To make sure to keep it a nose out for the skunk, huh? There was some dried <laughs> owl <laughs> necromancer to round out <laughs> Because it's always the dead, bloody three. Has been half gods who can't help but make their irrelevance everyone else's problem. Oh, you've got some juicy little tidbit I haven't heard yet. Huh. Hmm. It seems like my intelligence on you was patchy at best. That's annoying. I had no intention of leaving my city in the Dead Three's hands. So, as long as you can keep a lid on what's growing inside you, simple enough, I reckon. Now, war to be fought. You need anything? Well, Min, uh, she won't, huh. she will, she refused to call off, uh, the people she sent to kill Minsk. Boog tried his best. I am interested in gaining access to vaults beneath the Good counting night, house. She plans to ambush Minsk at the counting house. I know where we're going, Boog. What the hell's what you want there? <laughs> what you do with that information is a matter for yourself. Now, back to the vault keys. Do we have business to conduct? I have no Until keys to sell do, at the then. moment. Yes. Later. <laughs> Later, Boog. Later. <laughs> I know where we need to go, Boog. They said something about Minsk being at the counting house. Counting house, counting house. Die. House, counting. He's all wild up. Min, what do they count at a counting house? Money. Oh. Mm -hmm. There must be a lot of money if they need a whole house to count it in. Indeed, Boog. Come here. Okay. Oh, okay, I know what we're doing here. Hey, Boog. Yeah? You see that building right there? That big one? Oh. 
that's a really big house. There must be so much money to count in there. Yes. Yes, Boop, there is. Oh, so you want to buy some fish? Sure, Boop's a little peckish. Uh, not the fish Boog was hoping to eat. Mm. Yeah, but uh, beggars can't be choosers. Who can still make an exception? Difficult terrain one. <laughs> oh yeah, it is. the stuff that you know impedes everybody else is really rare. <laughs> yeah, really, really rare. Yes, take your hedgehog and go. Take your hedgehog and go. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh my god, game time! Well, at least she still has her voice lines there. <laughs> do I have it equipped? I do! Hell yeah! This is gonna be great. And then they jump back up. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> but they're all really hurt. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, no man. I've been ensnared! Ow! Oh no, my dignity. Ow. <laughs> also, remember, no resonating key. Do you see those two people who are there? Yep, that's why I didn't there have- There are civilians! <laughs> I thought for half a second of having Karlak use uh, one of her javelins, pro uh, Trident's properties to blow a gust of wind to knock them into the water, and then I saw the people at the end of the pier. I was like, I can't do that. You guys... Lightning and cold, okay. Oh my god, there's a person right there. Yep, right next to me. Yeah. Uh-huh. I know. I didn't see him before. And that's the reason I didn't have Carlac uh, shoot a gust of wind down that dock. <laughs> body, my weak <laughs> wizard form is in so much pain. I'm actually fine, Jack. I don't have snacks. Go away. <laughs> Hi. 
Hi. Hi, baby. Hello. Hello. You're very cute. Yes. Good job, G. You're a good kitty. <laughs> Puppy dog, hello. Hello, puppy dog. Hello, puppy dog. Hi. Mm, what a cute little puppy dog he is, too. Mm -hmm. Hi. killed them. <laughs> Thank you for cutting those creatures down, truly. Gods know what would have happened if you weren't here. Ooh, money. <laughs> Gods, do they stink? What is in your smelly bag? Oh, gods! There's guts all over my boat! Oh, that's right. The reason we can, uh... That we kind of find out about the sunken throne. The Iron Throne. The shoe wagon? The wagon. God damn those shoe wagon. Yeah, I am magnificent, thank you. Oh, that's right. It's illegal Selfie! to dig up that dirt pile. pile. Sophie, and she asked if I can read. Oh, you look like someone who can probably read. Can I Boog thinks you're making a very a big assumption. Please, boy, we all know Boog cannot read. <laughs> exactly. Another sale. Boog will take oh, one. No. Maybe Some he'll like bodies. the pictures. Oh. An entire 
session dedicated to one lord and his metal toys. Gordash has got to be paying them out sync fees. Min looks actually depressed that they are dead and she cannot speak with them. Aww. <laughs> She's like, I cannot help this child. This is the one thing I can do, and I cannot do this. My calling in life. Oh, hey, there you go. Talk to that lady. Talk to that lady. Talk to the lady. Oh, right, 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 Talk to the lady. Right. Talk to the lady. Yeah. My gods. Carlac Cliffgate. That can't possibly be you, can it? Fitz! If you want a sight for sore eyes. Where the hell have you been, girl? Last I heard you'd run off to Neverwinter, and that was what? Ten years ago? <laughs> Neverwinter? <laughs> Who told you that? Gortash. Said you didn't even give notice. Ah, that prick, but... <sighs> Never mind that. Look at you. The years have been good to you. I won't lie. They have. Well, go on, girl. Tell me everything. First thing first, you saw the news, didn't you? About Archduke Gortash. Right? Oh, I'm sure the oh, yeah, you read the thing about Florek earlier. How many house. days do we have left? I think you were the only thing that kept him a little honest. We'll be okay. After you left, okay. things got dark. Fast. I got out while my soul was still intact. Started working for an arms merchant. Still in the trade, as you can see. Met my fellow Gregor that way. Been together eight years now. And Carlac, we have a little one on the way. Fitz, that's incredible. Congratulations. Mum life, huh? You're going to be incredible. Gods, I hope so. Even after all these years, it seemed to happen so fast. But now that you're back in town, you must come to ours. All of you. We'll have a good supper, catch up. You can meet Gregor. And the little one in a few months. Are the two of you together? Uh-huh. Isn't he handsome? Absolutely. <laughs> You're well suited, I can tell just by looking at you. Pleasure to meet you, by the way. I can't tell you how good it is to see you, Fitz. I'd love to come have dinner with you and Gregor. We're in the city on some urgent business, but can I come find you when it's all settled? I'd love that. Meanwhile, if you're still in the business of intimidation, you should take a look at my stock. A lot of specialty arrows. Hmm. Hmm. Great to have you back, Carla. Oh, that's right. Did you look at the robe that uh, Roland had, by the way? Oh, no, no, no. I haven't yet. Uh... The wearer casts arcane charge whenever they're hit by an attack. Plus two bonus damage with spells. How does it look? Uh... It looks alright. I appreciate it, but it's definitely still more of a wizard thing. What? I, you handed me the bit in time, right? Or the bided time? No. That's not the, the robe, robe you gave me? No. That was a long time ago, dude. Oh, why do I still have it in my Roland has then? it. Oh, Roland has it. For sale. Or oh, no, no. I never got around to looking at it. Ghost Roland. I, that's why I was saying you need to go look at it. Okay. Oh, my God. Carly also wants to talk to me. Hang on. Hope that wasn't a lie. I, mean, I hope we do get to meet up with Fitz when this is all over. <laughs> First step, save the city. Then save myself and last but not least dinner with an old friend 
What more could you ask for? Okay. Oop, no. You were seen stealing. <laughs> Resolving this peacefully will require more caution than you. What was taken is free to be reclaimed. Okay. Wasn't even trying to touch that. <laughs> Let me introduce myself. I am Roland, the new ruler of. I hope you enjoy this curated selection Look of goods how pretty for he looks. all your magical needs. <laughs> Take your time. Uh, I don't think he has the same robe anymore. He just has a bunch of scrolls and then a simple robe and a sorcerer robe. Everything. Thank you for visiting Sorcerer. Maybe the lady in the back has it now. Among her books and scrolls. I can kill it again. How are you feeling, books? Still sensitive? Uh, but I had to, like, make amends with her last time before I could do anything after that. Oh, he doesn't have the same rope for sale. He doesn't really have any of the same items, pretty much. Intriguing. You checking to see if he himself is selling stuff? Not really, no. Oh, okay. I don't want to stop saving you guys. You guys are my favorite. <laughs> I mean, like, if I have to keep... Like, if you guys are not in danger, that's cool, too. It's just, you know. Hi, Roland. I knew Leroy can amass knowledge like a dragon with its horde, but never could I have imagined such wealth. And the tower itself has a cannon. The sheer power is mind-boggling. Roland, your face still looks worse than mine. Yeah. Indeed. I must still figure out its intricacies, but uh, I am close. Oh my god, Boog, I am adorable. Study and catalog it. Leroy <laughs> barely knew his alphabet. Then share it with the realms. After all, it does little good collecting dust in an old tower. Hmm. Oh, you're sitting on his book throne. Look at me! <laughs> Look at me! I'm losing <laughs> you! Yeah. Am I gonna do the swingy feet thing? Oh my god, am I gonna do the swingy feet thing? <laughs> She's done it before. I've seen her do it. It was cute. <laughs> oh, oh. There it is. There it is. She's not doing it on my screen. No. It's cute. <laughs> like she, instead of sitting like a little princess, she actually sits with her feet like comfortably and then she kind of swings her feet a little bit. Uh -huh. I knew Le study and catalog it. Leroy can barely knew it. Indeed. Leroy can didn't even know his alphabet. <sighs> Have you seen this? Luke, do you know yours? I think it goes without saying that uh, room here. Anytime. Uh, well, that's not important. Boog doesn't have to know his alphabet. He hits things with his fists. A bookman should know his book letters. I thought you were going to say that you don't need your, to know your alphabet because you have me. <laughs> I mean, Boog does have you as well. They got rid of the corpses, but the exploded bits of LaRoque and are still here. <laughs> <laughs> and 
And now I feel uncomfortable about that. Because <laughs> it now no longer counts as a corpse, and now Laroakin is just there forever. <laughs> And that makes me feel kind of like a bad person, in a <laughs> small way. <laughs> Long rest? Yes. Long rest. Minsk is working for the cult. Damn. He must have been tadpoled, or worse. The real Minsk would never join up with the God's damned absolute. Maybe we can help him. The prison, right? He should shut that tadpole up. If he doesn't kick our butts first, it's kind of his thing. Go on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, did you hear it? Or not, too, but Minthara thinks that it's amusing that uh, Minsk has become uh, taken over by the Absolute. Because. Oh people her people would tell stories to beware of the ranger with the purple scalp and uh rodents <laughs> like that's a very interesting and very specific story Minthara. right A bit busy at the moment. We'll talk later. <laughs> What's up? Let's in the color. Yeah. <laughs> he wears it well. He does. This chest near Withers has money and a couple of smoke powder arrows in it. Cool. Take it. Okay. How you doing, Gail? Go ahead. I'm listening. Listening is how he's doing. I've often asked I myself guess. the same question. <laughs> Never really found a satisfactory answer. Nearly see something in me that I can't. Wisdom and intelligence Ow. required to overcome almost insurmountable odds, perhaps? All the stupidity required to attempt it. Yeah! You don't get to be 13 centuries old without becoming a sound judge of character. Oh, that's cool that he's such a cheese connoisseur, <laughs> Scale. <laughs> Glad to hear it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> What's the matter, Boog? 
Let me guess, Gail wasn't even actually bothering to protect me while I was in a oh, conversation with him? Oh, he was 100% him. putting up the arcane ward oh, okay. every time. <laughs> Sitting there like you ain't done nothing. <laughs> Just chilling. Yeah, me too. Just hanging out. I'm ready to go to bed whenever you are, boo. <laughs> like a proper lady <laughs> as one does ah uh, how nice what it was even more funny <laughs> You can only hit me with AOEs now. <laughs> oh no. That would be so difficult to do. <laughs> no, I know you've got him. Not the majority of the spells that I have in my repertoire. Yeah, but you can't shocking grasp me anymore. At least not until I actually throw an attack out. Unnerving. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Shoot. Did not actually mean to leave the room. Scratch had something. Oh, you can actually control these ones? No. Okay. Because that one just walked all the way up to me when you said that. <laughs> what, when I said, aren't they cute? Yeah. That's actually really funny. Hang on, now hang on, let's uh, let's talk about this like, uh, you know, like civilized folk do, <laughs> you know, um... Oh my god. have an army of the undead now.
<laughs> Ray, this is... This is too much fun. <laughs> Problem, Ray. <laughs> I think both you and me have uh, made utterly broken characters in both our own ways. You have a giant army un of the undead, and I am a fucking unstoppable monk that can punch someone like fucking 18 times in one turn. But that being said. I, uh... I'm not done, either. I'm just I still gonna... have, um... I have, um... I, I have one more thing to try. Hang out over here with my sanctuary. Wait and see how this goes. Prolax backing you up, and if things start to go bad, I will walk over and help you out. Shovel. Oh yeah, you do have shovel too. Hmm. Shouldn't have been there, kid. <laughs> Well, he fucking zip zoomed out of there like nobody's business. Really did, didn't he? Hi. <laughs> so I have some controllable ghouls and uncontrollable ghouls. The fun part is figuring out which are which. <laughs> Uh, this one is immobile because it is maimed. Yeah. Oh my god, the cat is walking around the background. <laughs> the black one from sh the one that invites you to uh, worship Shares. Oh. <laughs> Because they had to dash, I see. Yeah. I get it now. Okay. Uh, he is also maimed. He cannot do anything. What are you gonna do, lady? <laughs> uh, how about how about no? Oh shit! <laughs> just, oh. I didn't think about that. I use up my sanctuary. All right. Well, I'm in it to win it then. But I got the uh, necrotic life got skill my one. Babies. My babies. <laughs> Wait, can I? Could I? Is that even possible? I think I might have lost a couple. I don't know. Yes, I did. Okay. So there is a limit. Hmm. Or are they reintroduced? Interesting. You know, this one, I know for certain. If I walk over here. Yes, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna do a little 
sticky stuff over here. Yep, there is a limit. Okay. Yeah, I think you can either have ghouls, skeletons, or zombies. You can't no, no, have there's different spells. Like yeah. one of them was my actual spells and then the other one was an ability spell thing that I have. No, okay. Cause I have one that comes from an item and then I have one that comes from my actual spells. And then the other one that I have is the Dance Macabre. So that's what I was testing. Gotcha. Which is why I wanted to do this in our not save. <laughs> <laughs> Actually. There we go. They don't save, they become infected. Oh, right, 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 right. And then become spooky ghouls themselves. Yes, Shovel, you're very scary. <laughs> is dead. <laughs> Boog got knocked down. Uh, no. no I'm the displacer beast. Down. Boog is standing on top of someone who is down. This might come in handy later for stuff, you know? <laughs> I mean, knowing the limits of your powers is very helpful. So that you don't make you mistakes. I 
and also because it's just really funny. <laughs> Boog! Boog, look what I've done! <laughs> Boog, is it not amazing? Min has so many friends now. It's very squishy. Okay, run away. Bye, Boog. No, 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 no. A little bit further this way. Okay, right. Oh, what? Not like a four percent chance that I get you in it. Shoot. Okay. Actually, can I? Take him then. Okay, there's a much better chance I can take him. Uh, over, over here seems good. Okay. And I may have angered more people fist into this, it's fine. Your ghouls want to explode? Apparently. <laughs> I have no control over them, so, you know. They're allowed to do whatever they want. so that I maintain my rage. So critically miss, apparently. And there go all of them. Yep. Nice. Also... Oh wait, no, there's one fit. Two fists. <laughs> oh yeah, Boog, just uh get close to the tower filled with guards. That's oh, I'm fine. not I'm not getting close. I'm placing illusory copies over there. The guards don't know that. Oh, I forgot it leaves a illusory copy where I teleported away from.
<laughs> Nap time. <laughs> Oh, my potion of haste wore off. Impromptu sleepy sleeps. <laughs> totally accidental. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not to do anything science related. snoring noises <laughs> <laughs> Good, yeah, shoot at me. <laughs> They're not gonna shoot at a sleeping target. Cause, you know, what if I wake up? <laughs> <laughs> that would be bad. <laughs> snared me. Uh, use, uh, the Misty Step Scroll. Can I? Oh, I cannot use scrolls of the Displacer Beast. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> you have to be able to talk. Uh...
Ah, I see you no longer beast. Yeah. <laughs> Oh no. Well, that's not fair. Also, did my ghoul kill the fist or did the fist turn into a ghoul? Uh, I think the. The fist turned into a ghoul. Yeah, the winged horror. Oh, wait. <laughs> no, the ghoul killed the fist. Its body is still there, I can see it. Yeah, you're right. Not as fun. I'm sorry, Rim. <laughs> it's whatever. no longer entangled, huh? <laughs> Don't believe so, no. <laughs> You probably shouldn't have, right? No, I was just Death mimicking the noise the fist made when I poked it in back. Being sarcastic. I was just like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you climb that wall. <laughs> Turn to normal. Yeah, I think uh, we're officially starting to get too strong. <laughs> Alright. Thanks everybody who dropped by and hung out. Uh. <laughs> and oh I'll God. see you all next time. Bye bye now.